Hello, this is Tom, a.k.a. Jenon here with Tabletop Tap Room, and today we are looking at the latest incompetence from Wizards WotC, where they released the new 6th edition release dates and then retracted them. And uh, what does that mean? But before we get to that, let me just say thanks for watching the video. Thanks to my subscribers. You guys are great. And don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and bell icon. Moving right along. So uh, just recently, we had PAX Unplug in, uh, in, in uh, Pennsylvania. And this was released in conjunction... And it clearly says 2024 core rule books releasing in 5-21-2024. This was put up there and then taken down. Let's just, uh, and replaced with this one. And, um, you know, this is, uh, it was, you know, some people have said, well, you know, maybe, Maybe it's not really the correct. No, it's probably the correct release date. Why would it be taken down? Well, it would be taken down because we are on the cusp of Christmas. And if you're announcing that, you, oh, that's right. They're not calling it 6th edition, but it effectively is with all the changes that they're doing to it. They just don't want to, they just don't, you know, they're afraid to stumble with the change that you get in additions. And the fact that, they put this up, this got put up, and then got pulled down, uh, and now they're doing this. It really tells me that uh, uh, May 21st is the new release date for the new core rule books. And what they're afraid of is they're afraid that people will stop buying 5th edition rule books here before Christmas because they really need Christmas to – they really need to sell as much as they can. And they, you know, uh, what was it most recently – d and is under monetized. So they really want to sell off as much as they can on 5th edition before they – and with a, with a hard and fast date, people will just be like, well, I'll just wait till then because we're only really talking like six months down the road now. You can wait six months and play with the books you already got, can't you? You sure could. You sure can. So um, it's just – to me, it's just crass that they're like, oh, we got to milk. We got to milk these fools for everything we can get out of them. Now, this, a little bit blurry. I didn't get a good image of it here. But, it again, um, it's 2024 uh, release schedule. And you can see the uh, Vecna Eye of Ruin is coming out uh, May 21st. Player's Handbook is coming out May 21st. And the making of Dungeons and Dragons, uh, which is coming out June 18th. So, so it's not the only thing that they put out to say, hey, we're releasing this. And somebody went, what are you doing? We still got books to sell. <laughs> uh, and that brings me to my other point. As just recently, I did a video called Bones to Pick. And uh, Bones to Pick... Uh, I, I named Wizards of the Coast the most incompetent game company of 2023. And I think I might have hinted or suggested that there's probably just more. There's just it's only a matter of time. And I hate to say I told you so, but I told you so. <laughs> uh, I was right, and it was only a matter of time. And then we had more incompetence coming from Watsi that uh, clearly they just made an unforced error by releasing the wrong thing, then retracting it. And, oh, we got more books to sell, which just shows how they view their customers. Oh, we, we, uh, we, we just were under monetized and we want to, you know, we want to put our hands in your pocket and just take everything, which is kind of what they were proposing to do with the OGL scandal, with the new OGL, uh, the revised OGL. Um, it, it just it, it just leaves a bad taste in your mouth, uh, especially where Watsi. So again, this is the most incompetent company in 2023. 
just one unforced error after another. And yet again, they, they do it again. They do it again right before Christmas. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to just bet the odds and say, I bet there's another one for New Year's Day. I bet there's another unforced error by Watsy before New Year's Day. Um, it's just only a matter of time. And again, I told you so, most incompetent game company uh, in 2023. And we really, I don't think it's going to turn around. And, and so this is the company producing the sixth edition. That's not the sixth edition. Uh, you know, how how well play tested is that? I, I just I'm expecting 2024 to be just more and more of the same. Doesn't I don't see anything to suggest that they are gonna get better. So here we go. This is Tom for Tabletop Tap Room signing out. Play whatever you like. Uh, I hope you pick uh, third party publishers. I hope you pick um, indie games. I hope you pick. OSR games. Uh, don't expect much from the uh, incompetent fools that uh, Watsi is these days, even though they are a big game company. Just don't expect much from them. Uh, again, thanks for watching the video. Thanks to my subscribers. You guys are great. And don't forget that like, subscribe, and bell icon. And have a happy holiday season. Uh, as we run up to Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever it is you celebrate, please do have a good time. Enjoy family. Enjoy friends.